I know I'm not a big-time treasure hunter like you, but I doubt you're gonna find Eldorado in there. How'd you get yourself in this mess? Trying to rescue you, as a matter of fact. Oh, that's so sweet. Traditional sandstone, brick, and stucco. Limestone mortar, huh? How'd you get to know so much about this? My show, episode four, Architects of a New World. Yep, it'll just take a tug to pull these bars out. What? No, wait, are you sure? Get out of my way, puto! Hey, Batman, open this goddamn door! Oh, crap. Hey, Drake. Eddie Raja. <laughs> I should have guessed. Fascinating document, huh? Seems like this Sir Francis was in my line of work. Don't flatter yourself, Eddie. <laughs> Always ready to be enemies, eh? <laughs> Tell you what. Lead me to the gold. And I just might let you live. <laughs> Is that it? Is that my deal? Die now, or help you, and die later. That's oh, a tough call, but you know what? I'll take die now. Die, Kamu! Listen to me, maggot. I was promised treasure on this goddamn rock. And now, my men are dying. They can't even go outside to take a piss without an armed guard! And I have nothing to show for it! I am making you a fair offer. You help me find the treasure, and the last man alive gets the gold! And the girl, of course. The girl? Oh, Eddie, the girl's long gone. She's probably off the island by now, going for help. Dai Kuching, you were never very good at poker. I will find her. Trust me. How much trouble could one girl be? Well, come on! Thank you. Hey! Ah, damn it! Okay. Nice work. Thanks. Uh, hey! Hey, book up it too! Alright my friends, welcome back to my brutal difficulty walkthrough for Uncharted Drake's Fortune. This is chapter number 7, in my opinion one of the most annoying chapters in this game. Especially on brutal difficulty, because you can die at any point during this chapter if two enemies hit you at the same time you're dead. And there's really nothing that you can do about it, because sometimes the enemies will be covered by trees and you won't be able to shoot them, but they'll still be able to shoot you, so this chapter, aside from knowing a few strategies that you can use, it also comes down to luck and you might grow a little bit frustrated with this chapter, it requires some level of patience in order to complete it but nonetheless it is possible to do it you might feel urged to keep firing your machine gun at all times don't do it, because if you keep firing the machine gun at all times, you'll notice that the aim will grow wider and it will be harder for you to hit the enemies. However, if you fire the machine gun in quick bursts, the aim will remain the same size and it will be much easier to hit your opponents. Aside from the machine gun, we can use the grenade launcher. If we fire the grenade launcher, precisely when our aim is pointing at one of the enemy's vehicles it will automatically destroy the vehicle so that really comes in handy as well but the most important thing here is not to go too trigger happy because that will actually affect your performance in this shutter as you can see it's much easier to hit the enemies if you fire in quick bursts instead of smashing the, uh, the fire button and you'll just keep firing for nothing and you won't be able to hit your enemies as well so if you use this strategy then sooner or later you will be able to complete this chapter but there's another thing after this next sequence we're going to restart the checkpoint that's very important 
destroy this truck there we go and now restart the checkpoint as soon as you reach in this area restart it just like i did here because you will die when you do that turn because you won't be able to aim at the enemy that comes from the side and he will fire at you immediately and you're most likely going to die so the most important thing after you destroy that truck is to restart the checkpoint and after this sequence things will be easier but as you can see because i'm firing my machine gun in quick bursts the aim remains the same size and it's much easier for me to hit my enemies and not miss a single bullet so this is a strategy that you can use it works pretty well but unfortunately it still comes down to luck at least until you reach this part when you're in this section fortunately there's not a lot of enemies coming at you at the same time so you can destroy them rather easily that's it for this chapter actually there's no more fighting it's a short chapter thankfully and if you restart the checkpoint halfway through the chapter after you destroy that truck then things will be easier but it's still going to be frustrating but nonetheless i hope my method works out for you and i'll see you all later for the next part this chapter was frustrating no doubt okay you okay yeah i'm fine Oh, but where are you bleeding? Yeah, it goes with the territory. Let's get the hell out of here. Damn it. Come on. <laughs> Going somewhere? Hey, Eddie. Did you really think you could escape from what? Oh, no, I just giving the young lady the $10 tour. Shut it. I bet you're working for them, too. What? You thought you could set me up and keep everything for yourselves, hmm? Get down! Damn it! This guy's crazy! Eddie, take it easy, buddy. <laughs> well, you're out of luck now! And out of road. Now, give me that map. Hold on. All right, you got me, fair and square. Hey, don't move. Relax, Eddie. Just get in the map like you asked. I said, hold on. I am. Well, hand it over. Well, now, you told me not to move. Looks like you're gonna have to come get it. Uh, come on. <laughs> 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 